Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to some more Kenchi, episode 26 with our series. Guess what? I've got a lot more of you guys added into the game. I went and did a ton of stuff off camera, lots and lots and lots of thievery um, and lots of recruiting. I've recruited a, a whole boatload of you and even equipped you guys, uh, most of you anyway. So going down the list here, starting with Skell Team 6. We've got, uh, I don't remember if I got these guys in last time. Um, Zeno, I think, Leroy, Eli, Tropican, Doc Drac, Moon, Rustman, No Name, Necron, Jamie, Skittles, Toothpick, Ivan, Howl, and Crunch. All of you guys added here to the new squad. Meanwhile, if we take a look here, um, we've got a lot of stuff that we looted. We've got some really nice weapons uh, that we've got. This is not your weapon. That topper is. So yeah, so we got some pretty nice weapons. Um, speaking of that, some of these guys don't have good weapons because uh, they're new recruits. So we got to get these guys equipped and then some of them do. But you can see Moon here carrying a bunch of stuff I'm going to sell. And then um, Rustman. See, No Name has a bunch of weapons and research artifacts. Who else is carrying stuff? And I think that might be it. And this was all just based off of all the looting. I'm carrying a bunch of stuff. I even got some ancient science books I looted. And uh, Hyper's carrying a bunch of weapons that we took. So we're pretty uh, pretty well set. We just got to get these weapons to our main squads. That's what's hurting us right now. So I went ahead and strike force error here. Being led by the Messiah Bjorg. <laughs> They've got a good amount of gear, but I didn't have enough at home base to equip them. Um, and we also got some more people in. If I actually look at Skelebros real quick, I'll introduce all the new characters here. So we've got Diesel, Womack, Felix, Gibson, Sandstone, Solomon, Kane, Toothy, Zippin, Tarkus, Cogs, Sucro, and Alice. So welcome to all of you. Uh, got you into the game as well. So at this point, we've got a lot of skeletons. In fact, we've got 87. Uh, that's a lot. <laughs> Still haven't reached the 256 limit, but... Mm. We're really, we're really uh, starting to grow here. It's pretty crazy. So a lot of these people need to be equipped as well. Uh, they are definitely not equipped. That squad's actually worse off than most of them. So right now, uh, that squad being led by Browser currently because he's the slowest member. Uh, they're heading this way. And this squad is heading this way. Although it looks like they're stuck. And it looks like they're stuck. So great. Uh, we'll go ahead and deal with that. Uh, right now, actually, because I want to get them heading there. So let's go take a look at Strike Force Error. At least get them across here. All right. So yeah, you can see some various weapons now. People have some heavy weapons, some sabers, but you're still seeing a lot of the blunt weapons, and that's because I can't uh, I can't swap those out just yet. Until I have more weapons to do it with. What is that down there? Oh, speak of the devil. I was actually hoping that we would get a, another one of these. All right, let's go ahead and get another mechanical spider into the fold. All right. Cool, so we've got one. Uh, not as tough as our other mechanical spider. Uh, he's 15,000. Let's go ahead and buy him and give him a name. I do have mechanical spider names, so let me pull them up. They weren't, uh, they were popular for a bit and then they fell off. So we got Spidey. And we've got Bismuth. All right. Cool. So now we've got Bismuth with Strike Force Error. Um, I'm kind of thinking that maybe I want him to be. I actually want him to be with Skell Team 6, but he can't make that journey from here. So there's no way he's going to be able to do that because they've got a ton of weapons. They've got to somehow be able to get back to us, which is going to take forever. Oh, boy. Ha. Choices, choices. Maybe Skell Team 6 will run into a group. Eventually, all these guys should have one mechanical spider in each force. Uh, as a unit that can hold like things like ammunition and repair kits and stuff. So as like a transport unit and they can also haul gear out of battle to be sold on the market or bought, brought back to base to be used by our armies. 
and uh, other and obviously for fighting. Eventually, I'd like if each squad had you know one to two. So it's good. I'm glad we ran into that and picked that up. He'll definitely uh, pay for himself. Probably not a bad idea to put a bone dog in every squad as well. Since we saw Inara's gotten pretty powerful. And every squad could probably use a bone dog. But, uh, because they'll get really tough. But, uh, managing the food wouldn't be that hard. We just throw some food in Spidey, so it's not that big of a deal. More skeletons here to recruit, but I've had enough recruiting for now. It's going to take all we can. I, I know I want to get more skeletons in, but it's really going to take all we can just to get the skeletons that we got um, equipped. Plus, I'm trying to save some of our cats here. Uh, mainly for repair kits. I'm assuming that's going to be the one thing that we're going to need a bajillion of coming up in the next few episodes. And actually, let me explain why. So what we're doing right now is Skill Team 6 is going to sell off the stuff that I've looted that I don't want to keep. And they're going to have the rest of the stuff. Meanwhile, the rest of the groups here, both um, Strike Force Error and uh, the Skelebros, are going to head down to this Holy Mine. And we're going to finally finish this Holy Mine off and wipe it out of existence. The Holy Mine is going to be some of the first places we're starting to attack. Now, we've got uh, some combat going on, so let's see how our guys do. All right, seeing a lot of red, but seeing a lot of green. Some of these guys have some heavy weapons on them from the uh, what I've looted from Squin way back in the past. And they've got some crazy dexterity. So some of these guys here swing these like, they swing these heavy weapons like they're katanas and they just do some serious damage. It's crazy to watch. So you can see we made very short work of them. It was very easy. He's got one guy up right now. Zeta's kind of handling it. All right, so obviously things like dust bandits and all that, not an issue anymore. Our biggest issue is going to be dealing with the holy nation or or goats. If, if we anger the goat god, which I don't want to do. That's a really small goat. Their stats are just insane. I mean, they're not like crazy good, but they're... They're, they're pretty good for goats. It's almost like an inside joke at this point how good goats are in the game. All right, so we'll send this squad off. Meanwhile, let's check in on Skelebros. They're trying to navigate here across the, uh, the wasteland that is the dead Deadlands. So let's at least get them to here. They can manage that. They're moving kind of slow because Browser's slow. He hasn't really gotten comfortable yet with his large backpack, but he'll get there. Just gonna take some time. Take some time for his athletics to go up and his strength. But good for him, builds character. Uh, the the strike force air will be able to strike at the holy mines before Skelebros get there. We're not gonna uh, not gonna need their help uh, for this particular uh, attack. It's just it won't be required. Um, let's actually grab Bjorg up quick and start sending him to the Holy Mines. I'm trying to think of the best way to approach. I guess I'll just try to attack it from the south. So we'll go ahead and give him an order to head that. Actually, let's send him here first because it's flat. Yeah, maybe we'll send him here if we can. It's always tough to know like what's actually open. Oh, you guys are nuts. You guys are nuts. I can't believe you're going. Oh, no. Oh my god, they just shot Browser for 151 from that turret. Yeah, we can't, uh, yeah, no. Eventually, we might be able to come and take these, but not now. These are active, by the way. And while I'd love to see us fight them, I'd also love to not see us fight them. Okay, somebody's bleeding. We'll deal with it. Spidey. Okay. All right, quick, before he flies away, somebody pick him up. All right, now somebody heal him. Okay, he's being healed right now. All right, I just want to make sure we didn't lose him. I want to get him down real quick and then we'll be off. So 
So we just gotta wait for his blood to go up. All right, I guess go ahead and pick him up. It could take some time. Meanwhile, we can keep following Browser here. Oh, those were right there. We didn't even know it. Oh, God. See, that's the, they all just sit still, and that's what they do. I guess there's a mod that lets you recruit them, too, which I did not know. And uh, I think it'd be cool to definitely get an army of them. So I'm somewhat tempted. Chikachi's now really dragging with Spidey. But he'll catch up. I'm just waiting for Spidey to to recoup here. I guess I can have everybody follow Jakachi then. Or Spidey, whatever. Or not. Alright, and let's send them this way. Perfect, so the groups actually will be able to work together. That's what I was hoping for. Alright, I'm gonna jump real quick to Skell Team 6. I just want to get this stuff sold. I want to get Skell Team 6 moving south. Uh, they're gonna stop at the Armor King real quick, and then they're gonna, they're gonna head south to uh, give us a hand with the first, uh, the first raids we're gonna be doing. So let's grab up Moon here. Uh, Moon's got the... Oh, no, not Moon. I'm sorry. Uh, who's got the... Is it Moon? Yeah, Moon's got the, the all the stuff I want to sell. Uh, I don't have anything to sell. Um, and, and everything else that I want to sell should be on Moon. I'm keeping these weapons for our groups. Uh, same with these weapons that Hyper's carrying. This is all for our, um, for our error group plus our new guys. Now, the new guys here uh, don't have weapons... And I probably should have equipped them. I forgot to do that. I thought that I did it. We can do it real quick. Where is Hyper? It won't take long. We just got to run down the list. Jay. Uh, you, you guys are really just better off dropping those. But I will keep most of you with Katanas. Probably giving you really nice stuff though isn't a good idea. I can give you more of the, like, you know, nice, but not like the guardless katana nice. <laughs> Blizmo, yeah, give me that. You don't need this crap. Blizmo, why don't you go ahead? We need more people with pull arms. I am going to be giving you guys whatever I can. Oh, these need to be sold, though, so I'll get those sold. They're just no good as weapons. Okay, Nadachi, Rotor, let's give you a Saber. And I, at this point, I'm just kind of mixing it all up. I'm not, like, focusing on one particular thing. I'm just kind of mixing up what everybody got, so that way we've got um, all sorts of assorted weapons. I feel like that's going to be what makes people powerful. Now, Rustman's actually a really strong crossbow guy, which is why I haven't given him a weapon yet, except for a Katana as a side thing, right? Oh, and Crunch. What do we want to give you, Crunch? How about a pull, pull arm? We really could use more people with pull arms. I'm saving this one for Zombie, though, because he's really good at a pull arm, and that's that's a really good one. It's either that or an Adachi, or, or you trade with Richard, because he's got some stuff. That might be useful. How about the frame axe? It's kind of cool. I'm literally strictly giving it to you because it's a cool weapon. It's not that great. It's okay. It's got good penetration. Damage versus robots is high, but that doesn't really help us. All right. Okay, and then anything I need to sell out of this pile. I think the rest of this stuff I'm going to keep. It's just these that I'm selling.
There we go. Everything else we're keeping for the group. Yep, everything else. All right. Um, do that real quick. Come on, Moon. Let's go sell. Now, we're not going to... I don't know if we're going to get all this sold. That's the problem. These guys are so slow, which is why I want to get a spider for these guys. But I have to find them. All right. I'd like to trade. So we'll get rid of as much as we can. You've got 25,000, so you're not going to be able to buy all of this off us. There is a bar here as well. This is good, though. Get rid of everything we can. All right. We could buy some stuff. I said that... Uh, What's his name? Rustman here is a crossbow guy, so we can at least give him a crossbow, but we don't have any ammo for him, and they don't seem to sell any shoddy. They don't seem to sell any toothpick ammo. And I'm not going to give him anything else besides that. Is there anything else I want to maybe buy? I don't think so. This is all shoddy. If it was maybe better. Because if I buy stuff, then I can sell. I could sell more stuff if I buy it. So give me the skeleton repair kit. There we go. Okay, let's go to the bar real quick. There is a bar here, right? Yeah, over. Where is the bar? Right here. Oh, this is, it's not really, it's like a bar, but it's not. We can sell the rest of the stuff here. Oh, she's only got 6,000. No, we can't. I guess we could sell the rest of it to the Armor King or we wait another day and try to sell it here. Ah, uh, you... Do I want you using that? Yeah, I guess it's fine. Get your blunt up and then we can give you something else. That That's not a big deal. Um... Yeah, trade with Rustman real quick. Give him that toothpick so I remember he has it. I just need to get ammo for it. Actually, I've got ammo for it, don't I? Haha. -ha. There we go. That totally not a bad idea. Not a not a bad idea at all. All right, rest of the stuff's all got to be sold. Oh, I guess we can start heading down back down to Wend. Kind of going to be a pain though. This group is large but full of a lot of weaker people so it's not like uh, it's not like a group that's going to be super tough alright I'm assuming Moon's still the slowest one here so and if we want to grab a group of Flot Sam Ninjas to take with us we got to look for them too but they'd probably be more down in the arm of Okrin I would imagine Uh, hopefully they don't run into a Holy Nation patrol, I guess. Speaking of the devil, Strike Force Alpha seems to be experiencing an issue. No, not, not really much of an issue, though. I mean, that bandit literally is running. He's retreating. <laughs> Goal. Retreating fast. <laughs> Grumpy pot. <laughs> oh my god. That's great. Alright, come on. Alright, well, how close are we to this Holy Nation mine? We're pretty close. Let's go ahead and get ourselves in position. This is going to be the episode we're going to take this mine out and be done with it. One mine down with a couple more to go. And then we can see in the distance uh, Spidey and uh, the Skelbro squad. But we've got a really large group of hungry bandits here. And they're probably heading straight there. We might need to meet with them first and deal with them the big the hardest part of this is going to be the fact that we need to it's going to take a lot of repair kits to manage this there's a lot of people on screen right now okay who's leading the them again the skelpros browser and spidey's still down he's good now who's carrying him jikachi is Oh, that's right. So Browser's not actually leading that group. Jukachi's leading it. 
So if I set them to follow, Chikachi should bring the group here. Meanwhile, let's have Strike Force Error um, deal with these bandits real quick so that they don't get caught up in our fight later and cause a headache. We should be able to clean them up pretty easy. All right. And we collide. Look at all of the numbers. It's just numbers. I can't even tell you what's happening right now. Bismuth here, though, like taking an instant beating. So he's going to he's critical and he's going to go down because he, he got in there too quickly. Let's see if we can pull him out and to keep him alive. Daedalus with us for some reason. He's not supposed to be here. Daedalus, you got to go back to base. You are not supposed to be with us. You've made a terrible mistake, my friend. Hans, can you get uh, that, that guy off Daedalus, please? I mean, Daedalus is doing a great job of holding his own, but yeah, he's not supposed to be here. He's supposed to be uh, with Blind, which I guess... We'll see if he makes it there. See you later, Daedalus. Thanks for, thanks for coming with us. All right, see you later, Bismuth. It was nice having you on the group. Oh, God, Zeta. Zeta, can you try... <laughs> can you go grab him? All right, and the Skelebros here for the first time. Um, these two groups reuniting after being separated for uh, a good episode or so, right? So, ah, Browser, you're not the leader anymore. I keep forgetting that. It was Jikachi, but technically you can be the leader now, again, because you're still the slowest. And both these groups outside the Holy Nation gates ready to strike. Speaking of Holy Nation, we've got some Holy Nation here we're going to have to deal with. So let's go ahead and get in position. We could probably have the shooty guys open up. Not all these guys have crossbows yet, unfortunately. But we'll get there. These guys are healing. See, this Holy Nation group does not seem to have much interest. Oh, it's like one of those recruitable drifter groups with the Holy Nation. That's what it is. That's why there's like a hiver here. It's just one of those recruitable groups. What are you trying to do? Oh, you're trying to go heal those guys. Yeah, but they can manage themselves. There's a bunch of them. They did make short work of the bandits. All right, hold on. Here we go. They're coming up here. You can heal him over here. Bismuth there just being tossed around like a sack of potatoes. Is that guy up? Nah, he's rebooting in a couple, couple seconds here. I want to make sure everybody's up and, and refreshed before we jump into this battle. So let's let the healing begin. I've got a lot of medics here, so it's not shouldn't be too much of an issue. And we have med kits. I, I did give everybody med kits. Oh, these guys, some of them getting back up. That ain't going to be... That ain't going to be an issue that I'm worried about. All right, let's grab our shooty guys here. Said not all these guys can shoot yet. We haven't gotten crossbows for all of them. I should have probably had uh, Strike Force Error bring more crossbows, but I completely forgot. Hopefully we can get some. Those guys outside the Floodlands, did they make it? No, I'll deal with that later. I want to take out this Holy Nation area. It's my uh, main goal right now. Kind of wanted to do it with a refreshed group here, but these guys really aren't that. There's not that many guards holding this. Oh, wait, they're fighting the... Uh... Who are they fighting? Oh, they are fighting that Holy Nation group. All right. This guy's pretty tough, but they're they're getting them. He is tough. Toothy's a newer guy, so it's nice to see the new guys get in there and beat up on him. A bunch of people just leveled up. All right, Bismuth, you up? Can I uh, drop you here? Yeah. As soon as I figure out who's carrying you, Zeta. All right, let's move, group. I 
want to get these shooty guys off to the side here. I guess the other guys that aren't set to range right now, no big deal. They'll just uh, hang out by the shooty guys and... And... Uh, do some protecting or something. I don't know. We're going to get the shooty guys right off here to the side. All right, we're just going to move this whole group in. We're just going to go for it. We're going to take this, this Holy Nation Fort down. If I'm reading this correctly, to destroy it... It's got uh, it's got a max of residents of 19. Actual number of residents is 8 currently. And it does have some roaming populations and such. But yeah, sh other than that, we should be able to kill it. By emptying it out. So let's... Uh, let's uh, begin this. All right. So already a bunch of guys storming right through the front. They don't even care. Oh, they're going to head up up here, which is what they should do. Take this turret guy out. Because he's going to be a problem if he's not taken care of. All right. So we've got fighting here at the front currently. Try to I try to commentate this the best I can. It's going to be probably a mess. So down here, we've got one Holy Sentinel. He's getting beat up by Gibson, Socro, Cogs, Vector, just a bunch of people. Kender's down there. Kender being one of our powerhouses. Meanwhile, Bismuth's inside. Anara's inside. They're storming the wall here. This guy is doing some serious damage shooting down. He just knocked, I think, Terra down. No, Terra's still up. Terra has no armor. How is that possible? Does Terra not have any armor? All right, Terra doesn't have any armor. I can't explain why that's a thing. Do any of these people have armor that are not faction? No. So we'll just have to figure something out. Meanwhile, they got to him on the wall, so he's getting the crap beat out of him. Rest of the group's going to start moving in. And we're going to pull people out of the bar. Iron Hands, let's go. And at this point, it's just going to turn into a mess. There's nobody in the bar. So we'll be able to loot this as much as we want. How about inside here? Is there nobody? These ones murdered Longshot. Oh, they remember me. Oh, Tommy there. <laughs> Tommy just like walked up and just unloaded a crossbow into the into this guy's side here. He's just look at they're just all shooting him. This is great. Toothy, Alice getting in there. Some of our new people getting in, which is great. Oh, that's a dust bandit. That's weird. That wasn't even a Holy Nation guy. All right, Bjorg, head inside here and check it out. Nobody in here. So is that it? Did we clear it? Stuff can be searched if need be. Well, I figured that there was probably nothing here. I, I hit it last time and I never really... I never cleared it up and I never really worried about anything else. What about in here? Place, this place is like, there's like nothing here. Home squad. Oh, Daedalus crap. What are you doing, man? You're freaking nuts. How did you get to the Dust King, King, King Tower? You probably could take out the Dust King, but yeah, it's a bad idea, man. Alright, I'm going to say that we've taken this out. I don't know how else I can I don't know how else I can handle this. It's pretty much is what it is. Diddles, you're under attack again or just God, your mission, Daedalus, should you choose to accept it? Get to the hub. I'm trying to deal with this here. Alright, well, mission accomplished. 
A lot of these Holy Nation guys playing dead. I think they need to be com actually completely killed, though. The only way to do that would be to get them to pick them up. We could throw them in the prison. Daedalus is fine. He's going to get there all right. There is a camp up here, but I think... I think he's going to make it. All right. I'm not going to worry about him. Yeah, I think we got to finish these guys off. Good. That's what I was hoping. They'd all get up. Because I got to be able to kill these guys. This guy is like a pincushion. And so isn't some of our guys, but that's all right. Playing dead, huh? All right, well, we'll put them in the cages, I guess. We can let these prisoners out. I don't know what happens. But I'm going to consider this one to be destroyed. I think we should move on to the next one. We had another holy mine up here I wanted to hit. <clears throat> There's a holy mine here right outside Bad Teeth. I don't know if we're ready to take on... We're not. Well, I know we're not ready to take on a city like Bad Teeth. He's playing dead. Playing dead. We can see if we can try and get these guys up. Nice. I think that was a pretty successful mission. Let's move all our guys outside. That mine's cleared. There's another mine that we got to go clear. Where's uh, Bismuth? Come on, buddy. Bismuth, what are you doing? How did you manage? Bismuth, how did you freaking manage that? Borg, come here. Get him unstuck. Freaking Bismuth, I tell you. Already being the freaking squad clown. All right. What do we got in here? Oh, Jesus. Oh, I didn't even know there was more Holy Nation, but here they are. And there's probably potential for looting in here. Here, Kender. What do we got? Some cats. Aha. A couple. Wow. Don't mind if I do. Crap. Okay, get the whole group out of here for a second. There's way too many of you. Give me Browser, because he's got the ability to hold stuff. And Kender. All right, we'll keep stuff on browser. I just, he's got a large backpack. I just want to keep an eye on who actually has stuff on them. And then I can load the stuff into, you know, whoever. Uh, probably Spidey or whatnot, you know. If I want to take the iron plates or anything. Uh, just building materials, fabric, stuff like that on all of this. Inside the chest that was locked, we've got basic furniture, blueprints. The only thing that's maybe worth anything is that. All right. What's going on over here? 
Just to add the drifters coming in. They actually knocked those guys out too. Nice. So browser here being the slowest. And uh, Bjorg. So this group here. We're going to want to... We could probably just keep them all together. Who? I think they will all follow Browser. I think he'll be able to... Uh, he'll be slow enough that they'll all be able to follow him. That group's actually fast. All right, let's head up to the next Holy Mine. We're just going to follow him right there. We're going to take the second Holy Mine. We're going to do it right in this episode. We're not even going to delay. Start knocking down Holy Mines here. I know you can get like completely destroy them, but I'm not sure. It says number of residents three. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Come back. So I actually did clear some of those guys out. I want to finish that off. So the people who are actually alive are holding me back from having it cleared. I want to have it cleared. If you actually, for the reactive world mod to actually kick in, you've got to be able to clear these, this stuff out so it could be taken over. So we got to find the last three. We know this guy's one and we locked one up in a prison. So he's down now. He's unconscious. Yeah, there's one up here in a prison. So somebody's got to go take him out and we got to beat him up. Oh, he's beating the heck out of Kane. Kane's pretty tough, though. Isn't he? No, he's not. Don't worry, Kane. Browser's up there to help you. Come on, Browser. Come on, Kane. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, yes. I'm confused, though. If I actually want to kill these guys and take this, if I want to destroy this completely, I have to kill every resident. Now actual numbers of residents is four. Oh, because I let that guy out of the prison. So if I put them all in the prison? Hmm. This is my first time using the reactive world mod, by the way, so I'm learning it still. So if I kidnap you and I put you in the prison, that that counts. Now let's check. Haha, so let's find the other ones. That are alive. Kidnap. And then two more out here. Perfect, Hans. Kidnap. DeVito. Kidnap. And this place will be 100% considered destroyed, I believe. At least it won't have any residents, and then I can consider it destroyed. And then we'll uh, move to the next one, which we will destroy this episode. Don't worry. It will be a longer episode. I was just going to say, these guys got to move and let these guys too. Oh, no, it still says two numbers of two residents. Oh, there's another one out here. So this is kind of different. I bet that there's better ways to do this. Because I'm clearly not doing this the right way. Alright, well you guys can let me know in the comments. We're going to head to the next one. I don't want to mess around with it too much. We got most of those guys locked up. I mean, this place is not, you know, efficient anyways at this point. There's nothing here that's going to be even useful. They won't be sending the the prisoners out to do any mining, I can tell you that. So at this point, I just would like to... I'd like to just have it officially destroyed if possible. But the next one's not that far away. It's only right here. It's a pretty short walk. 
And there's Holy Nation patrols walking around. And we got to keep an eye out for them as well. Now, taking out this one's going to be a little bit more tricky. I remember this one because uh, we've passed it before. It's a lot more heavily guarded. And I think it does have a pa uh, maybe a paladin or two. So this one won't be nearly as easy. Meanwhile, uh, Daedalus made it back to the hub. So why don't we deal with that real quick as soon as I get close. All right, Daedalus, we'll get you in the hub. Back with blind where you belong. And scale team six, they are currently right where I want them. So let's uh, let's move them through downwind because they're actually uh, they could get hit by the holy nation right here. I believe Moon is leading them right now. Uh, he's setting the tempo. Moon, there you are. Yeah, there was there was Holy Nation around here. But there's also uh, spiders. Right there's Holy Nation, actually. I'm pretty sure. Ah, uh, it is, but I think it's recruiters. The roaming recruits. I don't think it's a Holy Nation. Yeah, it's not like a Holy Nation patrol. Huh. All right, and you guys are heading down the river to the drowned ruins. Good luck. All right, let's go ahead and do our next battle. All right, and here we are outside of the Holy Nation Mine, the one that we're going to want to take out here. I think actually now's a good time to attack it under the cover of darkness. Uh, my game crashed, thank God for autosave. I can't say it enough, autosave is like a lifesaver. But uh, yeah, we've already done some damage to this mine actually in the past. We uh, came here and killed uh, a bunch of the guards and that's actually why you don't see any guards here. Because we killed them all off. So all that's left is the guards that are actually inside, which we're going to go inside and try to draw out. And there's some pretty tough guards in here. I think I'll send somebody out to actually get them out here and we'll try to meet them in front of the fort maybe. Um, I don't think I'm too worried about them manning any turrets. I don't even see anybody. Oh, we actually do got one guy up by a turret, but he's not manning it. All right, so let's grab Jikachi. He's pretty fast. He'll be able to run in, aggro a bunch of people, run out. We'll pull him out into combat, get this party started. So I pretty much just ticked off enough of them. Ooh, come on. All right, here we go. And is that us getting shot? I hope not. I saw 108 there. Who struck that? Okay, who? So what do we got here? What are we fighting? Holy servants. They are tough. A slaver. A holy ser. Yeah, the holy servants are tough. They've got stats up in the 70s. Even our toughest... Uh, Strike Force error bots are only stats in the 40s and 50s. So these guys are not going to be easy. It's going to be mainly numbers that are going to pull us through this fight. Um, there's a couple people that got wrapped up in here. I see more Holy Servants. All right, let's see how we do. Spidey and them getting in there. Nara, how are you on food? Kind of a weird question. Yeah, I had a feeling. Okay, so we'll have to get some food for Nara. We can loot it. From what's ever left of this place. So I'm seeing a lot of green. I'm seeing some red too. I don't think anybody's down yet. It's like five skeletons for every one holy servant. So even though they've got the power, we've definitely got the numbers. Oh, look at that. Anara got, got right in there. Just did damage. Clifton, come here and loot this guy real quick. I want to see if he's got food or anything. Nope, but I'm going to take this. High grade armor. Oh, and Clifton, you needed armor, so that worked out for you. Congratu <laughs> congratulations. That was, that was perfect. Um, you might as well take the bag, too. Alarm raised. But nobody seems to be moving. Meanwhile, most of these guys are not worth looting. Because they have faction gear. 
which is worth a decent amount to sell, but it's not really worth it to have. Um, I'll have Browser or somebody do the looting. Because he's got the bag after all, so I'll have him run around and loot stuff that makes sense to loot to sell. Because put it all into uh, Spidey or Bismuth, whichever one. Spidey's got some stuff he's supposed to drop off, but that's fine. We're mainly focused on this. Alright, we're going to keep pulling some people out. I just want to see what these guys got for weapons. Then I know what I'm up against. A lot of Paladin's Cross. Um, the Paladin's Cross does a lot of damage to robots. Uh, not too good against anything else. In terms of its... Uh, It's killing ability. Who is a medic? Bra uh, Browser, you're actually a medic, so pick up some of these bandages, because I believe I don't have any for healing Anara, which is a problem. So at least if you can have some on you, that'll be useful. Even with the Paladin's Crosses, these guys do not have very good Paladin's Crosses. They could be better. So that's lucky for us. Got caught stealing? Oh, no. Yeah, they're going to get up a couple times here. It's nothing we can do about it. Noctor was actually down. Which he probably would be. I think he's a newer guy. Alright. Yeah, Nara's going to need to be healed. And she's going to need food. Alright, Kender, come with me. We're going to pull some more guys out. We're going to keep doing this. I'm actually going to have him try to see if he can find some food, though. There's got to be food in here. The Holy Nation's weird like that, though. Ah, ration pack. Just enough to hold her over. Some dry bread, dried fish. Could you imagine if I had more of these dogs? I totally would forget. Okay, he don't really need to sneak. Uh, he Does he have good lockpick? No. Okay, so these things are just terrible. <clears throat> just a bunch of random stuff, but we'll take the food. Um, ah, research artifacts and stuff. Alright, so we want to get browser in here is what we want to do. Is there anybody upstairs? No. So let's, uh, let's pull browser in here. We'll have, uh, Kender here go trade with Inara. We'll have browser trade with Spidey real quick. Because I know he's got this. And then we'll send browser in here. So he can pick up some of this stuff that might be worth uh, looting or keeping. Definitely take the research books. Uh, the rest of this is actually worth a lot if you pick it all up. Um, we'll give these to Inara. I guess we'll work on browsers lock picking and stuff. There we go. Thousand cats. Hey. Can't, co can't complain. All right, so if we want to pick all that random stuff up, we can. And it can be sold wherever. We'll just throw it on Spidey. Normally, I would probably not pick this stuff up. But it is technically a lot of money. At least these things, if they're worth over 100 couple of cats, I mean, that's 1,000, 2,000 cats. I mean, if it buys us a med kit or something, it's... I think it's worth grabbing. What the heck are these bulls doing? All right. If we didn't have Spidey, I probably wouldn't waste the space. But because we have Spidey and he can hold all this trash. He can hold so much of it. and he sta It's stackable on him. It just... It makes a lot more sense to grab it. There we go. So now I can start eating. Meanwhile, Kender, it was you, right? You were grabbing stuff. I want you to give this food to Anara as well. Does you no good. Perfect. See, that's why I like the dog backpack. All right, Kendra, let's go grab some more people. The bulls are leaving anyways. I'm sure there's a bunch in here. Hello. All right, fine. We're attacking. That's fine. We're, there's not enough people in here anyways. I don't think we have to worry about it. Let's get in here and do some damage. All 
All right, people fighting up the stairs, trying to get to the second story where there's people. Meanwhile, these guys completely subliminous, and that's kind of funny because there's a large group of them up there. We've got a slaver and some holy sentinels, so not that tough. Right now we're fighting what? I don't even know. Cut them down. The heretics must be purged in flames. A holy sentinel. But, yeah, he's just being flooded. All right, let's grab a pretty large group of uh, portion of our guys here and send them off to the next area. The biggest thing is going to be trying to keep medkits on everybody. All right, let's go clear this out, guys. <laughs> oh, there's a lot in here, actually. A lot of holy sentinels. That's right, though. As we start the fight in here, they'll... Uh, They'll clear this area out and then more people will come join them. Eww, there is a lot of people in here though. There's a bunch of them upstairs too. But they don't stand a chance being overrun by just the sheer number of skeletons. There's just so many of us. Oh man. How's this looking? That supposedly has seven residents now. All right. Turn that slaver into a pin cushion. Browser, where are you? Hi, Ray. Convenient. All right, so there's a lot of healing going on. I need to find some more robotic repair kits. We're not going to find them here, obviously. We're going to need to go a little bit farther for those. The slavers actually usually generally has got some standard grade stuff that's worth having uh, the backpacks as well high grade for selling backpack for giving to somebody whoever you know get get backpacks going here not gonna waste my time letting prisoners out waging war anyways I could care less if they live all right so what do we got down here I never seem to find anything in these places I always expect to find stuff and there's never anything yeah see there's nothing in here. I don't know if that's like just because of the type of building it is. But there's never anything in here. And I doubt there's anything in here. We could take a look. None of this is locked. If it's locked, it might have, have some um, stuff in it, but it's not. And other than that, I think we've cleared this one out. Perfect. All right. We'll trade with Spidey again. Alarm raised. I see that there's a couple guys running around, but I'm not. They're just people getting up from fighting. These, these could be given to somebody. Who? Um, Solomon, you probably don't have any armor. There's a bunch of people who don't have armor. Oh, there's a lot of people getting up. But they're going to get right back down. Okay. Or not. Uh, trade with Grumpy Bot here real quick. Hey, yeah, he can get he can get the pants. He needs an armor as well. Trade with Death Knight. Oh, I know um Terra didn't. Look at Death Knight don't even have any Anything on him. He's running around naked. We got a naked skeleton. All right. Excellent. Solomon's down, though, but he'll he'll get back up. Any shooty skeletons? Nope. Strike force? Nope. They're all up. Hans, you want to come take this guy out for me? He's trying to escape. He's trying to, like, leap, throw himself over the edge or something. He probably can't handle. Oh, he's trying to stand post. That's awfully brave of him. Look at that swing. The skeleton will not prevail. I don't know, buddy. Looks like you kind of got knocked out. Awesome. So we've got another holy mine under skeleton control. It's only going to go uh, upwards of here. I mean, the groups are getting bigger and bigger. Meanwhile, Skeleton Team 6 should be outside or at least heading to the down ruin. So we'll deal with them in the next episode. We're going to continue pushing through here. I think uh, we'll head to the next holy mines over here. And we'll start taking this one out. 
Then we might uh, see if we can start ambushing some of the stronger Holy Paladin patrols and uh, really get our skills up. That's going to be what kind of helps build us up. Uh, ambushing these patrols and starting to fight the Paladins. We got to get used to fighting them. Uh, at first, it's going to be numbers that's going to help us, but eventually I want it to actually be our skills. Uh, we do have a lot of weaker guys among us with uh, weaker weapons and armor, so we'll try and get everybody equipped as we move along. And hopefully uh, try and uh, get some other stuff as well. I think getting people equipped is going to be a combination between um, Skeleton Team 6 meeting up because we got a bunch of weapons on them. So meeting up with this group and uh, whoever we, we kill out here trying to kill people and steal their gear. That'll probably be what uh, what will help us out. But uh, yeah. Yeah. These guys are desperately trying to hold on. No no match, though. <laughs> oh, man. We got so many skeletons. It's great. I'm glad to have all of you guys in. Seriously. It'll be a lot of fun. Meanwhile, ah, they're getting back up. Well, let's let, let's, let's let this finish off here. I see slaves are kind of just running around feeling like they're doing something. And the slaves now trying to break their their uh, locks. Because there's nothing holding them back now. All right. All cleared out and on to the next one. With that being said, I want to thank you all for joining me. I hope that you've enjoyed this longer episode of Kenshi. I look forward to seeing you next time.